At the Alamo Dome in San Antonio on Saturday comes the latest chapter of one of the greatest rivalries in college football history. Army and Notre Dame, two programs steeped in history for well over a century, share the same field once again. The rivalry between the Black Knights and Fighting Irish dates back to 1913 when Notre Dame visited West Point, an Irish win where the forward pass to a receiver in stride first gained notoriety. The teams regularly faced off for the next 30 years at venues such as Yankee Stadium, the Polo Grounds, Ebbets Field, and Soldier Field. However, the rivalry is best known for three games at the Ball Yard in the Bronx in the 1940s, games which are among the most memorable in college football history. Each year from 1944 to 1946, the Army Notre Dame game played a pivotal role in determining college football's national champion. One-sided shutouts by the Black Knights in 1944 and 45 gave Army its first two titles, while a scoreless tie in 1946, said by many to be the greatest college football game ever played, resulted in both the Black Knights and Fighting Irish sharing the national crown. Since that historic run of games, the teams have met more than a dozen times with two close calls. Army nearly knocked off Notre Dame at Giant Stadium in 1995, a game which came down to a late two-point conversion attempt by the Black Knights. Three years later, in South Bend, Indiana, the Irish prevailed on a late field goal. Most recently, the teams christened the return of college football to the new Yankee Stadium in a primetime game in 2010. Army and Notre Dame, two of college football's most storied programs, renewing a rivalry for the ages.